Hi, Brain Tech here. Where tech is made simple. So over the last year or so, as I have been posting, Google has been changing the location and the experience of downloads in the Google Chrome web browser for desktop. And as I have mentioned in previous videos, they have been pushing out using a controlled rollout the new download bubble and hub that is found to the top right in the toolbar of the Chrome web browser for desktop, which, which replaces the old uh, download shelf that has been around in Google Chrome for desktop basically since the beginning of the browser's inception and launch. And the download shelf uh, would show you your progress and you could also access your downloads from that shelf at the bottom of the browser. Now, as I have been posting, Google has been pushing out this new download bubble and hub progressively over the last couple of months. And it seems now that in the latest stable release, which is currently version 115, 115 of Google Chrome for desktop, Google now is starting to make this the default download kind of experience now in the desktop browser. Now, if you want any more information regarding um, the download bubble and hub, I have posted quite a few videos previously. So just do a search um, download hub um, Google Chrome on the channel and you will get more information how this all works and um, how this new hub and bubble operates. Now, the purpose of today's video is because um, I have seen a couple of comments on the channel and also reports where this new download bubble is obviously causing a lot of irritation and confusion for a lot of users who are used to the download shelf at the bottom and now downloads are appearing in the top right. So just a quick video to show you how you can actually disable this download bubble uh, in the stable version of, of Google Chrome for desktop and bring back the old download shelf and download experience in the desktop browser. And to do this, um, we have to disable an experimental flag. So it's not a default setting or option we can just change in the browser. We have to head to our experimental flags to get the job done, which we can do by heading to the address bar, typing in um, chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags, and this will take us to the experimental flags page. Now, all you need to um, type in is down load bubble. So here we go, and it says enable download bubble enables the download bubble instead of the download shelf. Now you can see that this is now a default feature. So the flag is actually set to default. That's why it's now placed at the top. So to bring back the old download shelf, we just change that from default to disabled. And then we'll have to relaunch uh, the stable version of Google Chrome version 115 to apply that flag. And now you'll see that the download bubble has been removed. And as an example, if I just do a quick download here, so we can just demonstrate for the purpose of today's video, everything should be the way it used to be. I'm just going to do a quick download, save image as, save, and there we go. There's the download shelf. We can see the download shelf at the bottom, and we can see the progress of our download. We can open that, always open files of this type, show in folder, and show all, and there we go. The download shelf is back by disabling that uh, download bubble um, flag, changing that from default to disabled. And something else just to mention, as I always do on the channel, uh, flags are not options, they are experiments. So at the time of posting, you can still disable the download bubble in the stable version, but obviously Google may remove that flag um, in a future update or a future version upgrade. So just take note of that. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.